if you are aiming to fail the exams that you've got to come up, then here are some top tips. One thing that lots and lots of students do is use these pens in an exam. These are friction pens. These are bad. Do not use friction pens in an exam. The reason that they tell you to use a black ballpoint pen in an exam is because friction pens will disappear really, really quickly. Now, when you do, I can like matches, I promise. When you actually do the exam, what happens is the exam paper gets sent to a processing centre where it gets scanned in. The scanner gets hot. So if you've written it in friction pen, you will see that when it gets hot, what will happen is the writing will actually disappear. And all of that hard work you did Okay, probably shouldn't have done that sitting under the fire alarm. But good news is fire alarms in my housework. But the point still stands that if you write in your exam in friction pen, your lovely, lovely maths equation, your very, very long essay for English, and then when it gets into the processing centre, it gets scanned in, and that scanner is hot because it's scanning in thousands, hundreds of thousands of pages of paper, then you saw how quickly that ink disappeared. You saw how it was just gone like that. You do not want that to happen to your answer in an exam. Now, if you have used friction pens in your exam, what will probably happen is that um, the examiner will notice hopefully something and then they will flag it for kind of like a manual or a um, like a manual mark and then hopefully the writing will have come back because this writing it's not completely gone it is still there and the way to get it back is to actually put it in the freezer to make it cold again and then the writing will come back but you are taking a massive risk here because you are relying on the examiner the person that's marking it on screen noticing that something is a bit odd in that you know you've done all of the whole paper and you've missed out page two flagging it for manual mark and then actually doing that or when you actually get to results day and you've noticed you've got four out of 100 on one of the papers which is a bit different then you can flag it through but but all of this takes time and all of this can be avoided if you just use a ballpoint pen in your exam so please don't use friction pens in your exam ouch This is why in some videos I write explain scratches.